Greetings from Open Research Institute. We are a nonprofit research and development organization which provides all of its work to the general public under the principles of open source and open access to research. We're primarily focused on digital communications work for the amateur satellite and terrestrial services. We believe that the lack of accessibility and access is a threat to both critical infrastructure and our economy, and we're doing our part where we can to address that. Our activities range from technical work to regulatory work to practical initiatives such as the Engineers General Program, citizen science initiatives, and more. So what do we do? We do FPGA design and development for microwave band multiple access amateur communication systems. This work delivers a hardware prototype that can be integrated as a satellite payload or as a terrestrial central node. Work is carried out by an international open source team using resources like the ORI Remote Labs, and taking advantage of community assets like the Vivado Floating License, and more. The hardware prototype is on the microwave bands at 5 and 10 gigahertz. If you have the skills or interest, you are welcome to join. Open Research Institute is the fiscal sponsor of the M17 project. This exciting project offers an amateur open source VHF UHF digital voice and data service that can be used today. Multiple hardware options are available or in rapid development. Ambisat Inspired Sensors. Taking the Ambisat open source satellite project, we add a microwave beacon to the sensor array and develop a path forward for amateur deployment of the main board. ORI does regulatory and legal work. On the 2nd of September, we received the third and final, in a series, regulatory results from the U.S. government on a year-long effort to free the amateur radio satellite service from ITAR and EAR. Open source satellite work is free of both ITAR and EAR, and publication rules have been clarified. This is the best possible result. The entire body of work, from the CJ request to the advisory opinion, is donated to the amateur community at no charge, and all documents are available from the ORI re repository. The link is in the notes. Current regulatory and legal work concerns debris mitigation and open source. There is a lot of good news here, and you are invited to be a part of it. The IEEE Space and Satellite Symposium is a half-day virtual event on the 30th of October, 2021, and all recordings will be made available. The theme emphasizes the intersection between amateur radio satellites and information theory, which involves the study of digital codes and modulation. IEEE Computer Society and Information Theory San Diego Chapters are co-sponsoring the event. Open Research Institute is the logistics sponsor. Speakers so far will present work on the QO100 narrowband modulator, link budgets for a new approach to Ambisat, information theory with respect to music, and open source LDPC work targeting FPGAs. Two pieces of space and satellite themed music will premiere as part of the event, and there will be an information theory analysis of the work. If you have ever wondered what the connection between math and music looks like, then this is your chance. Talks and development address the connection between amateur radio and the Mars helicopter team, the role of amateur activity in commercial work, and more. Open Research Institute is funded by your donations, Conference Badge Sales, YASME Foundation, ARRL Foundation, and ARDC. ORI works with Tapper in several areas, most visibly in support of DCC and at Hamcation. Tapper is a wonderful organization to work with. We are looking forward to another joint forum in Florida at Hamcation as soon as it happens again. If it's in person, then there might be a special event or contest. If it's online, then you will find us there. Want to get involved? Visit openresearch.institute slash getting dash started. Thank you so much to the Tapper DCC organizers for another great year of talks and open source amateur radio work.